Last week, rain turned that hole into a pond, but now the skies have cleared and we're getting a better look. Thanks for joining us on this Monday evening. I'm Luann Sorrell. And I'm John Brown. People who live nearby say they don't like what they're seeing either. And Fox 35's Chris Lindsay followed the story all last week and he joins us live once again in Ocala tonight. So, Chris, a lot of people around town are, shall we say, very nervous and anxious this evening. Absolutely. The last time we were here, this entire area was covered up by water. That flooding has since cleared out, so we can now see that that hole is much closer to the home than it's ever been. This is what it looked like a few days ago. Today was the first time we could see the hole has crept under the home, leaving a corner of the building hanging off. A note on the front door says the area is unsafe due to a sinkhole and recommends having it evaluated by an engineer. Neighbors are worried about what will happen if they see major rainfall again. You know, you certainly hope it doesn't happen, you know, in the house you're living in, and then you've got to scramble in the middle of the night and what it's important to you and you got to grab things and get out but I mean I guess it's part of living in Florida they can just pop up anywhere the people who lived in the duplex were forced to evacuate I'm told they've since moved into another one just up the street and I've reached out to the company that owns this duplex, Ellison Management, for further comment, and I'm waiting to hear back. The tenants, however, tell me that they've been very accommodating when it comes to this situation. Reporting live in Ocala, Chris Lindsay, Fox 35 News. A 